Hello everyone, welcome to Techie QA channel. In this video, we are going to see how to record HTTPS uh, request using SSL certificate. So by default, it will work with HTTP right for web and mobile both. For mobile, what and all we have to do, we have to set the proxy. So as I told you in the previous video, if you are not uh, seeing my previous video, please check our previous video also. So in Wi-Fi, we have set the proxy. Okay, this IP address is system IP address. Uh, port number is Charles uh, port number which I am using there. Let me open Charles proxy. So once you open the Charles proxy there you can see the proxy setting port number. So whatever you are mentioning here even there also you should give the same. So for this purpose I am planning to use uh, just dial the same. So HTTP also I have used just dial but there are some requests from uh, just dial is uh, it is like let me open so what happened HTTP is opening properly okay I can see all the request API everything but if you see HTTP yes is look like enabled because we have uh, did it we have enabled it here start just dial if you remove this also if you don't have this what will happen for just dial let's see see you can't see you can't see even uh, enabled mode it's all logged way okay only http1 will be enabled and you can see that request uh, you can read the content of that http request so what you have to do first of all the first thing uh, that https you should install your ssl certificate in your machine install ssl certificate so already we have done uh, like uh, with mac if it is windows also you have to install so mac you have to install and trust the certificate by double click here okay double click on this plus you have to trust here also if it is mac so once done then enable the host which one you want just dial right so start dot just dial dot com okay it's it started continuously recording so i removed all oh uh, if you now if you see the just dial https yeah see it's look like a different icon it's enabled even something yeah profile also we can see but if you see the request all are unknown inside why because you can see in overview client ssl you may need to configure a browser or application to the charles certificate so for this purpose what you have to do maybe let me go to browser go to charles charlesproxy.com slash get ssl so whatever you are seeing in the first uh, tab it will ask you to download the certificate yes then click on install give your uh, password install it yes installation done maybe now you can check it once again it may or still same yeah once you've done all this do one thing restart your Charles also once you've done the certificate thing restart your Charles in setting also you just have to enable the okay certificate is installed click on certificate certificate trust testing setting uh, go to certificate just a second let me open the things okay go to setting home just type certificate then certificate trust setting certificate trust setting then enable this and continue okay so root certificate is enabled now now you can open the just dial see you can see all the api before it was unknown right so if you are not restarting maybe you will face unknown again just restart your charles proxy 
okay so this is how we can track http and https both uh, request uh, if you want some other apps to be tracked be flipkart nothing to do just go to ssl proxy setting flipkart is already added right so i can track that also somewhere i can see oh flipkart one is not maybe the uh, yeah here it is so what i have to do take this uh, host and just go to proxy dot com is there no that's why i think maybe so i will add new one i will put just star okay clear we'll close and reopen the flip card You can see the mobile API, Flipkart.net API is also iOS. So iOS related API will be there. If you are trying to sign in or sign up, uh, just go to new, just type something, any number, simply for testing purpose. Go to five and check status. The content is, it's still okay. The number is user detail is not found, so it's an OTP. I don't know this number, whose number, so I simply enter. So, this is how we can record a HTTP case also. If you face any issue with sign up, we can see it here like uh, what problem came with API. If developer didn't share the API detail with you, you can still look into this way. So, the, the testing coverage will be more actually. That's it guys. So now you are able to track uh, mobile app, web app, HTTP, HTTPS, all. If you face any issue of uh, this web and mobile, or if you are facing any issue with Android one, you just put it in the comments. If really required Android videos, I can make uh, some separate videos if it is required. Please put it in the comments and please subscribe our channel for more videos. Thank you.